A state-recognized funeral held today at St. John's Native Baptist Church for a nation builder. The Reverend Dr. Hervis Bain Jr. was lauded for his stellar work stamping his seal on history by designing the country's national coat of arms and the Bahamian flag. His daughter Hervisa spoke passionately about her father and the love for his country. There was never any doubt that daddy would always keep us safe. He constantly pressed into us to guard our hearts. Whenever troubles struck, we always knew that we could come home. Daddy also provided us with an identity. He served his wife and his children. We were his family. We knew who we were, what was expected of us, and what the plan was, because there was always a plan, a method to the madness. So today I can imagine that he is once again taken flight, gone on before. He has left the instructions, I can hear him now, when you get there, ask for Jesus. He will have everything you need. Yeah, Daddy, I can hear you and Mama now. My great physician heals the sick. Also paying tribute was Prime Minister, the Right Honorable Perry Christie. He called him a trailblazer, saying he left an indelible mark. He has done more than enough to respond to this African proverb that I speak of often, that until lions have their own historians, the history of the hunt will always glorify the hunter. Until Bahamians could find a way to put their stories into writing, Herbis did. Herbert left his mom, and forever and forever, we will hold him up to future generations of Bahamians as a major contributor to the making of the Commonwealth of the Bahamas. In a few weeks, the Junkanoo season will be in full effect. Officials from the Ministry of Culture officially launched the Junkanoo season Thursday in a Junkanoo theme exhibit at the National Art Gallery. A poster competition is a new element that all schools can compete in for tons of prizes, including laptops and tablets. It's open to students from preschool up to high school, and winners will be announced over the course of the season. Junior Junkanoo will kick off competitive events on December 12th in a room filled with works by the late Brent Malone, Minister Dr. Daniel Johnson explained how they have transitioned from parades to now a Junkanoo season. During this season, there are 25 parades. 25 parades. This is what we have decided to do. Now what that does, it allows you to see a parade on different islands. It allows people who are visiting the Bahamas to see the parade in different places. But it also allows us, as the backer and the catalyst for Bahamian art and culture, to invest more time, energy, and resources into the development of this extremely valuable resource. It's the biggest fundraising event on the Bahamas AIDS Foundation's calendar to assist the thousands of people infected and affected by HIV and AIDS in the Bahamas. On November 14th, the red carpet will be laid out for a night of luxury at the 22nd annual Red Ribbon Ball. It's a worthwhile cause that many corporate entities have been supporting for many years. Commonwealth Brewery Limited is one of the major sponsors, and its president and managing director, Hans Nevin, says the company, which is a truly Bahamian company, takes pride in doing so. We believe uh, that we have to do a lot uh, to protect people from HIV and, uh, uh, and the consequences from HIV. Um, when I arrived um, a bit more than a year ago in the Bahamas, I was... Uh, very happy to, to realize that uh, Commonwealth Brewery was already very involved with the Bahamas AIDS uh, Foundation and mainly through the Red Ribbon uh, Ball. But also, uh, as you know, we participate in all the activities throughout the year of uh, the Bahamas AIDS Foundation. 
This year, Commonwealth Brewery will be providing luxury champagne to complement this year's theme, A Night of Luxury. Nevin is encouraging more Bahamian companies to support this worthy cause. In our vision statement, uh, passion for people is, is mentioned and is very important for us. So I think that uh, the Red Ribbon Ball is, is also very important for us to participate and to continue to participate for the coming years. Uh, I would like to ask everybody and as much as possible people to participate at this, this uh, Red Ribbon uh, Ball.